Hey guys and welcome back to another video. In a previous video I showed you how to turn a set of shelves into an overhead camera rig should you have the need to. Well today let's jump in and make a simple and portable overhead camera rig. Okay, so to achieve this, you're gonna need a couple of things. The first thing you're gonna need is some kind of like microphone boom arm. This is just a cheap one I picked up off of Amazon for around 20 quid. However, if you have a heavier camera, you'll probably wanna pick up something a little bit more substantial, something like the Blue Mic Arm or the Rode PSA1, I think it's called. One of those is gonna do you just fine. If you have something like a, an EOS R with some of that R series glass or a Sony with some of the G Master glass, something like that is probably gonna do you a bit better, but for the smaller mirrorless cameras with extremely light lenses, this, from what I've tested, has been perfectly fine. I almost took my eye out. Okay, so secondly, you're gonna need some kind of ball head. I have this one, which I stole off my Manfrotto tripod. However, I'll leave a link in the video description for a small rig one, one which which I'm actually using on my streaming setup just over there. Um, I use Arca Swiss plates because it allows me to kind of unify the plates across all of my smaller tripods for my mirrorless camera because that's the one that tends to travel around a little bit more on these various tripod varieties that I have like the Gorillapod and the Manfrotto tripod and then on there allows me just to simply pop it in no faffing around with screwing it to different various quarter 20 mounts etc so uh yeah ball mount that was kind of the premise of it i've kind of gone off on a bit of a tangent maybe but this did kind of lead to a good discovery that small rig do a very cool little uh little one of these that i didn't know they did before so go check that out link in the video description anyway so let's get on to how this all kind of fits together Alrighty, so you're gonna want to take this arm and you're gonna want to attach this bottom base plate to your table now you can use a cloth if you're worried about scratching the table because although this top bit has a little bit of protection on this on this particular mount uh, the bottom bit doesn't so you're gonna need something to protect your table if you're worried about scratching it for me this is usually mounted to my desk so it's not a problem however if I'm mounting it to my kitchen table or the coffee table then I want to do that just to preserve the actual finish on the table itself next thing you want to do is pop the arm into the base and then you'll want to screw the tripod head on, which is pretty simple, um, you know, just screwing a tripod head into a... Yeah, you get the point. All right, so now, you know, you've got everything on there. You can pretty much position it exactly how you need it. Just point the camera straight down and you've got yourself a tidy little overhead camera rig. And you, what, you spent maybe 30, 40 quid for this? Now, don't get me wrong, there are some much better solutions out there but this is meant to be cheap light and portable now i saw a video uh yeah quite recently on peter mckinnon's channel where he did a video with the guy that does the throwing of the things onto the table i can't remember what it's called but that guy had a really cool overhead camera rig set up which was like clamping onto the table then it had an adjust a height adjustable pole and then another cross pole and it was cool uh, but it was like 150 quid or something so that was kind of something that inspired the thought behind this video it's taken me a while to make it because i'm lazy and i've had other videos to make as well but i do hope that gave you some kind of nice cheap overhead camera idea to work with should you need one so like I said, there are links to the two things that I used in this video in the product description. Feel free to like the video, don't forget to comment, get subscribed, like the bell to stay up to date for whenever I release a new video. And until the next one, see ya.